Hello friends, I highly appreciate the comments you sharing for my videos and I'm thankful to all of my subscribers for positively elevating and propel my channel in such a short time. I assure you all to keep you updated about the techniques you need to know about the M engine's maintenance and troubleshooting steps. So do keep watching my uploaded and upcoming videos. Friends, during routine maintenance on ME engines, there are certain jobs which demands the position of the piston of unit number 1 to be at top dead center. Few of such jobs can be flywheel position pickup sensor replacement, the angle encoder replacement, the taco system alignment and so on. In this video, I'll explain you how to verify the crank throw of cylinder number 1 is at top dead center. So please do watch the video carefully till the end. Guys, it's worth watching. As mentioned earlier, certain jobs necessitates the crankshaft position to be at 0 degrees with unit number 1 piston at top dead center. To confirm this condition being fulfilled and to ensure the correct crankshaft position relative to the bed plate, a special tool is provided to check the same. Using turning gear, position the crankshaft such that the 0 degree mark on the flywheel is in line with the indicator. Open the crankcase door for unit number 1. Inside the crankcase, you can see the crank web of unit number 1 has a punch mark embossed on top of it. Also, there are four punch marks embossed on the forward side of the engine frame. Using a special tool, authenticate the punch mark on the crank web is coordinating with the marks on the engine frame. In case the above condition is fulfilled, it's confirmed the crankshaft is positioned correctly relative to the bed plate with unit number 1 piston at the top dead center. Friends, there are chances to shift the crankshaft position while carrying out the timing chain tightening. So do take utmost care to tighten the trial chain considering the position of the crankshaft. The misaligned position of the crankshaft can adversely affect the performance of the main engine. So guys, the procedure to inspect the crankshaft position is very simple and I would strongly recommend to inspect it on your engines at your earliest convenience. In my next video, I will describe you the step-by-step -step procedures to deal with the taco alignment error alarm on an MAN BMW 6S60 MEC 8.2 engine. So don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe my channel to keep yourself updated with the techniques to work on electronic engines. Thank you for watching the video. Wish you all safe seas and healthy stay on board. Thank you.